Hi there, welcome to Electronic Stuff. Uh, in this tutorial, we're going to be discussing how to discharge a capacitor through a transistor through a NPN transistor. Okay, guys. So now I'm going to introduce my components. Okay, that I've gotten to to build uh, this project. So up here uh, on my left, the um, uh, 1000 microfarad capacitor. It's a uh, negative uh, pin is going to emitter to the emitter of my transistor. Okay, and the positive pin is going all the way to this pin of my push button. Okay, guys. Now, uh, the transistor is the uh, STC945 NPN transistor. That's the emitter, collector, and the base. Okay. Now, from emitter, okay, okay, um, I've here my uh, 220 ohm resistor, okay, uh, one of its uh, legs, okay, is to be connected with a uh, collector, okay, of this transistor, and the other, uh, the free leg, okay, is to be connected with negative side of my LED okay and the positive side of my LED is going to VCC 5 volts through this um, pin of my push button okay now um, from this uh, from this uh, pin of the push button to base of of uh, my transistor okay I've gotten the uh, 10k ohm resistor okay guys that's our build I think it's clear it's uh, uh, clear okay guys now um when i press the push button the led will go on okay and the um and uh, the capacitor okay will uh, uh charge okay when i press the push button the LED is on and the in the my capacitor is going to be uh, charging okay like so I press so uh, my capacitor in this instant is charging okay um on releasing okay uh, the push button the led is always on because um uh, the capacitor okay is feeding the tra my transistor okay and uh, it's going to be discharged okay in few seconds okay guys the LED um, is going off okay because the uh, the capacitor is discharging okay guys through this uh, through this transistor okay
now one thing to keep in mind the value of the capacitor okay and that of the resistor this resistor okay which is connected to pin um, to base pin okay uh, they determined uh, they determine uh, the time delay or for how long the transistor stays uh, in the uh, in that conducting mode okay guys uh, so the uh, the LED is going off okay guys if I uh, press the push button uh, okay uh, again one more time okay is on okay and the capacitor uh, is charging when I release it is is always on because uh, now the capacitor is feeding the the transistor okay with a current flowing uh, okay uh, from uh, from my capacitor to this transistor okay and the the transistor allows um, the LED to be always on okay even though the uh, the push button is not pressed the LED is on because this guy over here is feeding the secret okay so now uh, we, we, we're going to see um, how long the LED st uh, uh, stays on okay um, uh, I'm going to to get my phone guys i'm so sorry this capacitor ain't uh 1000 microfarad but um 470 microfarad okay capacitor so uh, i'm so sorry for misleading you now we're going to to see the time okay how long um the transistor stays in the conducting mode okay how long the uh, led okay will stay on okay so i pressed let me press okay we're gonna see um, seven nine okay Oh, what is that? Oh. Many flies over here. <laughs> okay, so oh. 
okay guys i think it's okay for now we can say the led stays uh, on okay uh during um more than one minute i think okay okay uh, guys that's uh our schematic okay so here this is not um 1000 microfarad okay uh I'm using uh, 470 microfarad instead okay so that's the uh, the 10k ohm resistor with the base here is the uh, collector emitter the push button the uh, 220 uh, resistor the LED 5 volts ground here. Okay, guys. So, thank you so much, and uh, see you in the next video. Bye bye.